Welcome back to Deus Ex Mankind Divided. We just finished checking out almost all of the apartment buildings, except the one that was security level 3, so I couldn't get inside of it. No multi-tools left or anything. So now it's time to explore the rest of the city. So I'm just right immediately outside of the apartment building. Uh, I guess I'll check out some of the stores around here. Also, by the way, I found out what was wrong with the map. So I don't know if you remember, but a little while ago I was kind of confused about how the map was working and I figured out why. It's not because I'm misunderstanding how it works. It's because just like those newspapers where the way you scroll through them can totally break them, this seems to be similar. The map is actually just totally broken. Um, so you notice how there's this little square in the center of the screen? This works 100%. If you center one of these points of interest inside of the square, it will tell you what that is. Like look, merchant, apartments. Landmark, Merchant, Merchant, Landmark, Metro. So that works. However, if you try to mouse over anything, it does not work. <laughs> it doesn't work at all. Like, most of the time, you mouse over something like this and absolutely nothing appears, as you can see. Sometimes something does appear, but it doesn't appear in the right area. Like, it says there's a sewer here, but no. There's a sewer here and here. There's no sewer here. Like, it just doesn't... It doesn't make any sense. So mousing over stuff does not work in the maps, but centering it does. Which is very, very strange. Uh, I don't think the PC port of this game is entirely up to snuff when it comes to the UI. Oh, yes. And apparently I got another Praxis point, I guess at the end of the last episode. I, I'm not even sure exactly when. But now we have two, which means I can get something good. I'm going to go ahead and get Social Enhancer. So it should allow us to understand a bit more about how people are feeling and hopefully say the right thing when it comes to dialogue. Yeah, as it says here, Dialectic Enhancer. Dominate conversation through chemical manipulation and strategic speechcraft. Allows user to persuade and interrupt during conversations. Do you have like a quest marker on you? Or is that just like a, a LiDAR thing? T on Mark. There we go. You looking for the best prices in Prague? I'm not talking hot dogs here. If the hot dogs aren't your main business, why don't you have a store? See, this way, I get to keep my overhead down and pass on the savings to the customers. Entrepreneurial. Better believe it. What did you got? Well, I got info. The kind that's worth something. Could always use reliable intel. Who couldn't? But for that, I only accept payment in Europazine. No problem. What do you have? Hmm. Okay, so I guess I shouldn't be selling that stuff. At least not for money. I should be bartering with it. I think I do have one on me. Info A, B, or C. Well... I guess I'll just pick A. Sophisticated choice. Okay, looks like that's all I've got. Maybe I'll come back later. Pleasure doing business with you. Let's see what we've got. Encrypted data file. So it's like scraped from a network something something something. Reports of possible shots fired in Preg... Preg... Pregad... Oh my god. Prekazga. Prekazga. Building 37. Chicken foot. Chick... What? Is that the... Is that like a restaurant? Is that the name of it? Current assessment. No officers available. Prekazga. Prekazga. Where... Where would that be? Is that somewhere here? Prekeska? God, this place is so big. Huh. Irish stool. Is that a bar? Or is it just a bunch of... Is that just where Irish go to shit? Theater, apartments, the Red Queen. There's so much here. Coffee shop, limb clinic. 
Uh, I don't see it immediately. Hmm. Maybe we'll come across it. Okay. Another merchant over here. Is that Svobody body beer? Probably just alcohol and things like that, but let's check him out. Is it, is it this place? <laughs> That's a cool little place. A little newspaper stand with some drinks and stuff, snacks. Wasn't there somebody out front of this when I originally came by here? I assume they were the owner of the stand, but they're gone. Yes. What? No customers? <laughs> New regulations for augmented citizens. Update 7.2. All augmented citizens of Prague will be required to carry a T-73 permit verification card by the end of the month. Please allow for two to three week application processing period. Uh, oh, it's just a bunch of license crap, blah blah blah, authentication card, R-class augment license, T-73, blah blah blah. What can I get you? Beer? Something else? What else have you got? Oh, just an item of interest. For someone who lives off of their sales, you're unusually reserved. Well, sometimes it's hard to know who to trust, especially these days. For example, I don't suppose you have any neuroposine you would be willing to spare, do you? Sorry, I don't. That's okay, I understand. Times are tough. Is there anything I can do for you? Nothing, thanks. Okay, but I'm not sure why you wasted your time coming in here. Well, geez, don't need to be mean about it. I might be a customer in the future. Yeah, so apparently Neuropazine is kind of like the bartering item of choice here. More than money, it almost seems like. So I really need to hold on to those when I find them. See, I've already gone down into the sewers. Can't really go anything down. Can't really do much down there at the moment without the rebreather. I think there's actually another way I could have gone down there, but I'll, I'll save that for later. Ooh, Church of the Machine God. Yeah, let's see if we can learn more about the cult there. I'm assuming that is the cult. The one that the, the builder was working for before they were uh, excommunicated. Doesn't look like much of a church from here, does it? Locked. Oh. Uh, I guess they don't just take visitors? Use church keycard. Need church keycard. Yes, I was thinking I don't have one. <laughs> huh. Surprised I didn't find one at the apartment. Uh, razor wire, it goes up super high. I don't think I can just jump over. Oh my god. Look. Whoa. Look at all those wires. Yeah, this must be the Colt. I'm sure those aren't just for looks. They must be for whatever projects they're building to try to ascend everybody. Okay, show off. So if I break my way in, is everybody going to try to shoot me then? I mean, I could try. If it's not a restricted zone, then I'm good. Oh, wait a minute. I can't even hack it. What am I saying? I just need a key card. I wonder if a multi-tool would work on a card reader. Probably not. I assume it wouldn't work on anything that you can't hack normally. What happens if I take the Metro, by the way? Or, oh, I guess I probably can't. Looks like everybody's being kind of stopped, huh? Just wait. Colder, I'm gonna freeze solid. 
We're free to go. Oh god. Nah, I'm out of here. Bureaucratic nightmare. Oh, disgusting. So there's not too much more to do here before heading over to the other district. Actually, there might be nothing more to do here, in fact. So there's some places marked on the map as, like, places that sell things. Praha, mini market, but if they don't have this merchant thing, then I'm assuming that means there's nothing there, right? Like, this mini market says it's back here. Huh. Okay, well, the building's here, but yeah, there's nobody to talk to. But there might be stuff like a computer. Okay. Wait a minute, this music. I'm pretty sure that's music from the original Deus Ex. Computer isn't even locked. From Office of Permits. Dear Mr. Edward Broad, this is a reminder of the deal you made with the official Office of Permitification. Given the tenuous nature of your demand for extended legal status, you will need to pay more. I will be sending some men, and you will pay them. Is that that asshole I spoke with before? Drahamir? That is that person, isn't it? Ah, prices for... things. So yeah, some of these stores, even if they're not marked as being a place where you can actually buy or sell something, might actually still have some sort of a building. Ooh. I can go back here, can't I? Rodko Perry Campaign Headquarters. I want to go there. I think I remember when I was going to the bookstore, there was a gate, which is probably that gate. Killed me past the police checkpoint. Yeah, let's go check it out. Oh, wait. This way. Yeah, not a restricted zone. That must be the pawn shop. I'm sorry. I think we'll shop around. You won't find better prices anywhere, mother. The attacks have driven. What happened here? Good money on this road. We got oh, wait a minute. The chicken foot. That's where there was shooting, right? That message. 32. Yeah, this is the place. It's not even marked on the map. Uh. Are they. It must be quitting time soon, yeah? I guess they're not dead. I said I could try to talk to them. They're just, uh, sleeping? <laughs> I hope. Cannot breathe in this thing. Hmm. I shouldn't go in there. So, can I do anything with this building? I mean, there must be some use to that intel, right? If so, then there must be something I can do. Windows are all boarded up. So, my friend, you have the car, yes? Fuck off. The police are just as corrupt as the rest of us. I wasn't paying attention. What are we doing now? We got this. All areas are secure. Continue the general patrol. Ah. This uniform is heavy. What kind of stuff is in there? Lots of random junk. I don't think I need a bicycle or anything. See what's a oh my god security rating five that's not gonna happen. I'm sorry, I would rather not talk to you. In my opinion, your type are a big part of the problem. My type? 
They can't be talking about people with augments because they have augments. I wonder what they mean then. It's the campaign headquarters. Radko Perry. <laughs> People just defaced all these posters out here. Wireframe. Nice. Hmm. Memorials? I know a guy. Roger. Oh. Oh. Must have been people that died and whatever happened there. Ooh, hello. That's very interesting. Anybody home? Radko Perry bursts onto local political scene. The following is a transcript of a speech Radko Perry gave last week as he opens his campaign for head secretary to the office of the Regional Inspector of Municipal Affairs. Wow, that is a mouthful. Head secretary to the office of the Regional Inspector of Municipal Affairs. <laughs> a big title for a man with even bit bigger political aspirations. We mustn't fool ourselves, friends. I expect a difficult campaign. You can bet the elite liberal media will be hell-bent on attacking my character. Crowd boos elite liberal media. <laughs> it probably has something, something to do with my unflinching resolve to finally rid our fair city of every last mechanical abomination. To resolve, once and for all, Prague's Og problem. Crowd cheers. My competitors will argue that the AUG question doesn't technically fall under the domain of the head secretary to the office of the regional inspector of municipal affairs. They will tell you that we must wait for the UN. Radko bangs podium. Crowd cheers. I, Radko Maximilian Perry, will not wait for the UN. An AUG is a disgusting mongrel, an affront to all that is wholesome and human. Worse, it is a walking bomb waiting to go off in front of our wives and children. If your elected officials are telling you that something of such magnitude isn't their problem, you must demand better elected officials. You must demand Radko Maximilian Perry. Radko drops microphone, crowd erupts. Did you really just do a, a microphone drop? It's official, Radko Perry is running for the position of head secretary, the primary function of which is to inspect the city's sewage and waterworks. And he's doing it on an anti-AUG platform. <laughs> That's hilarious. What's not so hilarious is if early polls are to believe or to be believed, his strategy is working. And now for a close look at events making headlines around the world. The impact of the Let's see, can I somehow sabotage their campaign? Nobody seems to be home. Yeah, nobody's here. Ooh. Ooh. Security rating one, easy. Uh, so it's gonna go this way, this way, this way, this way, so. Oh, yeah, yeah. Whoa. What the? Huh? Why is the security bot shooting me? Is it because they saw me hacking? Okay, says so the panic is ending. 93, 95, 96. I'm gonna see if they're considering me a hostile after that ends. Are we good? Or are you just gonna shoot me on sight? Okay, we're good. Good. I think they shot the door off though, yeah. I, yeah, I didn't know those things would be angry if you did something like that. Because so far, I'm pretty sure people have seen me hacking things before. But I guess the bots in particular, and I'm assuming the police as well, probably have a problem with it. So, let's hide here and crouch down. That was an unpleasant surprise. Oh, I can't go that way? Oh, crap. Ah, uh, just disconnect. It's not gonna happen. I messed that up. I thought it wasn't directed. It looks like this isn't directed, but yeah, you can't go that way. Alright, uh, let's go this way. Uh, 
Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. But the non-augmented peoples of the world have failed to grasp this. Activity detected. Was okay. But it wasn't all of humankind who went crazy, Dr. Rucker. 200 credits, pistol, and overclock software. Hmm. Wonder where that goes behind that dumpster. I probably can't move it though. Let's see. I think I'm safe here. Oh, security rating 5. Nope, nope, nope. Okay. There was a terrorist bombing at a local church. But but Ark had nothing to do with Well, that's where it's coming from. There. <laughs> Much better. Yeah, I can't do anything more there. All right. So, yeah, I think that's pretty much it for this place. Oh, yeah, we still have this. That's the the forger upstairs. But they seem pretty well armed there, and I don't have all even my basic augs. So I think I want to wait a little bit till I'm a bit more powerful before I go there. So let's head across. I think we have to go through right here. So this is where we need to go to go across there. However, I noticed something. There is a place we can go up there. That building there. I can open the windows. Fucking Nobody in here. Whoa, calm down, Trashman. Per Aspra ad Astra. Uh, per Aspra ad Astra, or simply ad Astra, means through hardships to the stars. We are a community-minded support group established in 2028 by American expatriate Royal Crosby. Our goal is to rebuild the community of man by helping the augmented reintegrate into our neighborhoods. Our belief is that through compassion, understanding, and respect, we will find harmony between the augmented and the naturals. Oh yeah, we saw that note from somebody who was living on a roof about Ad Astra. Yeah, you can read the rest of this if you want. Hydraulic micropump. From Elispk or LSPK, I don't know. Uh, Franca, I heard about Thomas. I don't know what to say except that I'm so sorry. When I heard about the bombing, I never imagined anything like this. I suppose no one ever thinks that someone close to them will be caught up in one of these attacks. Is there anything I can do? We can come into town to take care of little Peter. You've won! Winning notification! Lottery winners! Mm -hmm. Congratulations! <laughs> Due to a mix-up of some numbers and names, we ask that you keep your winning information very confidential. Uh-huh. Yeah, really not much in here. I like the way the flashing lights of that police car shine off like the whole screen. You don't want to keep doing that. I think I do. We got another one here. Whoa. Oh, this place looks so cool. I love it when, like, nature is sort of taken over. Places are kind of partially destroyed. Is there anybody here? What is this place? Electric hazard. Hmm. 
So it's taking me into the underpath. Security cams? City tour. Oh, maybe this, I guess this used to be some sort of a tourist place. Yeah, let's maybe leave that off. Ah, uh, needs to be turned on to access that. Oh no. Still disabled. Huh. Not sure what to do with that. Ah, uh, I see. I don't have the uh, the augment that allows me to punch stuff, so I can't punch through this. It's another one of those basic ones that I need. Now this isn't showing up as a restricted zone. Already read that. Whoa. Wonder what this stuff's doing here. I wonder if I could get past this if I, like, stood on top of this. Any other way through? Don't think so. I think it's either through here or through this. If I was able to actually punch it. Actually, you know what? I wonder. If I throw this, I wonder if it might explode and blow it up. Not quite. Probably if you shoot it, it would. Okay, I think I've picked up some weapons. Yeah, sure. This might hurt me from here. Oh, damn it. It's not explosive. It's just it's a very, very, very bad smoke grenade. Whoa. People are in a panic? Wow, I, I didn't think anybody would hear that. I can't even see them. Alright, well, that's fine. No biggie. Okay, step one. That works. Uh, I'm gonna need more of these, though. Yeah, we're alright. Oh, there it is, the breaker. Ooh. Do I have some painkillers? Yeah. Cool. And a stim. Alright. We're good. I love that you can do silly stuff like that. Like dance on top of a bunch of boxes to get over. 
an electrified zone. Oh, wait a minute. Where's this leading out to? Oh, this is where I was going to go in anyway. Yeah, this was what I thought was the entrance to the underground. Well, shit. Huh. That's not going to take me where I want to go. I just noticed through this door here, the one that I can't open even if I turn the power on, there appears to be the world's largest mushroom. I really want in there. I'm thinking maybe I have to go to the metro to get to the other side. So that's the oh, naturals shit. line. This is the AUG no line. No fucking hope. Don't do anything suspicious. And it worked. I never asked for your services. Excuse me. Yes, you have some questions. More and more of them. Do you need Augs to build it? What do you want, Clank? Get back to your squat, or I'll send you someplace even worse. It's being built by the augmented for the augmented. How is it different from the Utala complex? Okay, I guess we made it through. Utalek was a place to put people, just a way to move the problem somewhere else. What's in there? No person. Can I keep this pamphlet? Of course. Have a good day. Who are they? Sir, there's a better life for the augmented, and it's waiting for you in Rabia. Ah, Rabia. Better future for Og. Good afternoon, sir. My name is Felice Almen, and I represent the Santo Group. We're looking for able-bodied augmented persons like you to help us create the future. Don't take this the wrong way, but this might be the wrong town to hawk a dream of the future in. Don't you think it's exactly the right one? Prague, a city with no respect for the choices its citizens made to become augmented. The choice you made. And you're going to tell me Santos found a city that does respect us. We're making it. You can't deny the world has to change. For the better this time. Augmentations helped us take great steps before. And we can do it again. In Rabia. A concept city. 3D printed. Beyond state of the art. A symbol of evolution. In the deserts of Oman. I've seen the new stories. But Santo's not a charity, and I don't think your stakeholders are philanthropists. That's why they've asked people like me to spread the word, to make an offer. Incentive-driven employment for any augmented person. You'll get a sponsored work permit for the duration of the city's construction. And after that? A guaranteed place in the residency lottery. <laughs> Lotteries. <laughs> lottery. Oh yeah, I feel real secure about that. What's the difference between pessimistic and cynical? Aren't they kind of similar? The future isn't something a corporation can create and sell at a premium. If anyone knows that, it's the augmented. Our augments were sold to us, weren't they? And we took them and we used them to change our lives. The future is a framework. Santo is the only corporation in the world to increase its augmented workforce in the past two years. Did you know that? That must be convenient for a construction business. It's the opposite. Our CEO's life has been threatened for supporting the legitimacy of augmented people. But he, Mr. Brown, understands that the augmented saw the future early and rushed to meet it. So this incentive program, positioning Rabia for the Augs, it's all on Nathaniel Brown? Everything. The industrial printing of the city, the archaeological design, the recruiting drive, even the street teams. Mr. Brown met us personally to sign off on us. Would you believe it? 
Yeah, I think I would. Archaeological? Architectural ecology. Rabia is zero footprint. Fully self-sufficient. It is not just his solution for the augmented, it is his solution for cities. It is visionary. There is no other word for it. Right. Unfortunately, most of the visionaries I've met were so busy chasing their grand plan, they lost sight of the little people. I thought the Udalek complex was Santos' future for the augmented. From what I've heard, it didn't go to plan. Not to our plan. Utelek was supposed to be a low-cost, high-volume housing solution for transient workers. It was never meant to become what it has. And why didn't Brown step in? Doesn't look good to have your name associated with an all ghetto. It's out of our hands. Since the incident, it's been run by the Czech state and their police. That will never happen with Rabia. They're surprisingly convincing. I mean, the place sounds pretty good on paper. Of course, uh, a chance to live their lottery after working to build it is shit, but... What guarantee do I have that life in Rabia is different than the segregation here? Or is that a lottery too? Santo is the guarantee. We keep the rights to the city in perpetuity, never handing it off to people who want the augmented out of sight and out of mind. But that's still exactly what you're doing. A city in a bubble, born from fear between augmented and non-augmented. There have always been divisions in society. There always will be. That's why there are walls. Someone has to build the walls, and that's Santo. You've given me a lot to chew on. I can't sign up with you on the spot. Just consider it. What I've told you. I'm not trying to sell you the e brochure of Rabia. You've seen it all anyway. They're just pictures and holograms. I want you to believe in the place. We won't push you aside <laughs> for your own. I get to hack directly into the room that this person's at. What's in there? Stuff. Stuff that I want. And augmented people just like you are creating the future together. Security rating one. Santa Definitely doable. Security like rating one also doable. Together. What about this one? <laughs> Security rating three, yeah. A little bit harder. Alright, well, I think I'll end this episode here. So I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, I'm gonna check out these couple of rooms that I'm not supposed to enter, see what goodies are inside and then head down to the metro where I'm pretty sure we can go to the other district.